Welcome back, Lennies and bunny lovers. One of the biggest traits that separates rabbits from most other animals is that bunnies are virtually, well, silent, meaning they are not vocal. They don't bark like dogs, meow like cats, or moo like cows. This is why, in my opinion, rabbits make some of the greatest pets in the world because of their peaceful nature. The reason rabbits are mostly silent is because they are prey animals. Silence is one of their best defense mechanisms against predators, allowing them to remain discreet. Sadly, the lack of a voice is also one of the reasons rabbits are so mistreated, abused, and neglected. Nonetheless, rabbits do possess other ways of communicating their feelings to other bunnies and to you. And on occasion, you'll hear a little something slip out you never thought you'd hear. So in this video, we're going to examine all the sounds that rabbits make and what exactly they mean. Before we begin, please subscribe, like, and hit that bell for unlimited bunny content. The first sound we have is the almighty, all-glorious rabbit thump. This sound has become so synonymous with rabbit behavior that even the common name thumper is derived from it. The thump is used by rabbits to warn other rabbits of danger nearby. Occasionally, the domestic rabbit may thump as a sign of protest, indicating they are upset with or scared of you. Take their thump seriously and try to comfort your rabbit during this time. Sneezing. Rabbits sneeze because their nasal passages may become irritated. The cause of the irritation can be many things, from pollen to dust to even bits of their own hay and fur. A sick rabbit may sneeze if they have a respiratory infection. Chronic sneezing should be examined by a medical professional. Next, we have grunting. Yep, these delicate angels can also wake up on the wrong side of the bed. Usually, this grunting stems from being somewhat annoyed or grumpy, especially if they are hangry. It's them saying, give me the darn treat already or get out of my way. Snoring. Yep, this sounds pretty much what you think it sounds like. A cute little snort while a bunny is deep in their sleep. Snoring is rare and may be more prevalent in a bunny with respiratory issues. However, occasionally a snoring bunny is completely harmless. Purring. A rabbit purr is not the same as a cat purr at all, but possesses the same meaning. When a rabbit purrs, they will lightly click their teeth together. This usually occurs when they feel extreme pleasure and tranquility, such as when you pet or massage them in all the right places, or even when they're dreaming a great dream. It's their way of saying, please don't stop, keep doing what you're doing. In which case, keep doing what you're doing. Whimpering. Rabbits will whine or whimper for a couple different reasons. One, they might not want to be handled. Whining can also be a sign of protest or fear or being uninterested in another rabbit's advances. On occasion, a slight whimper can mean your rabbit is enjoying your affection. This is probably more of a moan than anything. Gulping. Weirdly, it almost feels like bunnies can gulp louder than humans. They love their water and they will take in more than their little throats can handle if they're that thirsty. But gulping also just means they're really enjoying the experience of hydration. Growling. 
similar to grunting, but a little bit more intense. Growls are rare, unless your bunny really feels threatened, angry, or stressed. You may be invading their territory and they're telling you to back off, or maybe they're about to fight another rabbit. Aggressive behavior will most likely ensue, so watch out. Screaming. Screaming occurs when a rabbit is undergoing extreme trauma, pain, or is under attack. A rabbit will scream over and over like an alarm call to warn other rabbits of danger, even if it is trapped with a predator. You may also think it sounds like whining, but it's not. Some rabbits have screamed right before their death. Hope that your rabbit never makes this noise, and if they do, find out the source of the problem and fix it immediately. Squeaking. Squeaking generally only occurs within newborn baby bunnies. The activity and noisy squeaking of healthy babies triggers the mother's maternal instincts. One of these instincts can include a feeding session. Like pigs, bunnies can oink, although some people also refer to it as honking. Either way, oinking is pure bliss. It's literally your rabbit really digging your massage while they doze off in your arms. <laughs> Consider yourself lucky and your bunny very spoiled, if you get to hear them oink. Loud teeth chattering or grinding means your bunny is in a lot of pain. It should not be confused with purring. This activity will be more intense and consistent than a purr, and may be accompanied by other painful behavior such as being hunched over or refusing their food. If your bunny has been chattering consistently, you need to take them to see a rabbit savvy vet as soon as possible. Finally, clucking. This is a happy sound that female rabbits usually make when feeding their babies, although sometimes you can hear it from a bunny who's just simply content. You might also hear it when a rabbit is sleeping or when they're stuffing their face with their favorite food. Well, Lennies, that's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new. And our question of the day is, what is the most common sound you hear from your rabbit? Comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe, like, hit the bell for unlimited bunny content, and we'll see you all soon. Bye.